It's time for another two-minute tech tip. Hi folks, JB here from the Oracle Jet product management team. In this two-minute tech tip, we're going to talk about adding data to your Jet application. When working with Oracle Jet, it's important to remember that Jet is a pure client-side toolkit. So if you're going to interact with data, it's going to have to be done through some kind of a web service. Now, these days, normally that's a REST interface, but it could be GraphQL, it could be WebSocket, it could be server sent event if you wanted to. If you're using JavaScript and doing HTTP interfaces or requests, there are a lot of different ways to do that. In this particular case, I'm just going to use one REST interface. This is apex.oracle.com running ORDs. Uh, and I'm I set up a bunch of different ways of actually calling out to that REST end endpoint. So here's a ES6 fetch. Uh, here's a get JSON using jQuery. Uh, here's Axios that I installed instead of using jQuery. You can use Axios. Uh, and even for, for just a little throwback and old time sake, here's an XHR interface that I created. Now, all of these go out and bring back a response object. And the response object contains the same JSON. It's all coming from the same REST endpoint. So once you get that response object and you get the JSON data, you can process it with just a single function. This shapes the data into whatever format the component you're working with is expecting. In this case, it's a Oracle Jet chart. Uh, so this is the exact same chart interacting exactly the same. The data looks the same, but it's all being pulled down with data in four different ways. Now, the one gotcha in working with web services is if you're using something like a SOAP interface that has XML that's bringing down on the data. If you're using something like that, you want to do the XML to JSON conversion on the server then expose that JSON data through some sort of an interface like a REST endpoint. Don't try and do XML to JSON on the client. It's a really bad idea and it's really bad performance. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Was that a good tip? This is the most fantastic story I've ever heard. We want your opinion. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.